there's a picture of a pink pig in the middle of a government map, but then they remember everything about the EU legislation. That's just how clever the mind is. Having a big colour pen, I call them the pen of power, in your hand is very empowering to get them to share that knowledge and have, they call them, the big conversations. Rich Pictures, basically, they started life um, as a tool where you try to get people to come together to explore, analyse a complex situation. So rather than talk about it, they would all stand around a sheet of paper holding felt-tip pens and essentially draw out what they think is important, what they think needs to be addressed. We're doing it to our needs. Yeah. It, it was been very big in America for a long time, particularly in community-based stuff and government stuff, but been very big, then moved into Europe. There's legislation, there's funding, there's best practice, there's you know, quality human rights. You can't retain that information, you can't even process it half the time. But it's done so simply in maybe three or four little icons strung together with a few stick figures, um, sort of with verbs doing and showing. Pictures also makes people sit in the middle of the conversation. You know, there's a pot of money, this is the amount of money, this is where they're spending it, there's three communities. It's a conceptual device to allow you to structure your thinking. They feel engaged, they feel listened to, and then you're going to get people giving you ideas. Tell us what you want to spend your money on, and here we go. Whenever you need good ideas yeah. to improve, I'll draw. My experience is so rich uh, that I don't think we realise that when we're putting it into a verbal form, uh, we're actually limiting what we can do. If you want to get people together and get them thinking together quickly, these are, these are the sort of tools that uh, are very effective. They find themselves expressing what they feel, how they see the world, how they see relationships in the world in quite a different way. I was working in southern Beirut. Shiites, uh, Sunnis, uh, Druze, uh, Maronite Christians, Palestinians coming together, uh, sharing a room, sharing a table for the first time in their experience. Those people in that context drew together. In the centre of the picture you see Don Quixote tilting at windmills. The whole sense of the pointlessness of much which goes on in that region is captured in that image. They're all drawing things, especially as a collective experience, and that's very empowering. By the end of it you'll have four or five points that you can then visually link up with themes, so it is a very good way of finding connections. The picture, the we, not just these are the problems we've got, they can also be a case of we must avoid this. Rich pictures can act very well as manifestos. Get more from the Open University. Check out the links on screen now.